Well, a secretly recorded conversation with Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito is now raising a lot of new questions about his impartiality in politically fraught cases. Correspondent Julie Martin joining us now from here in our Atlanta newsroom. Alito has been in the headlines for a lot of interesting reasons in recent weeks, and now we have this leaked audio. Good morning. Yeah, good morning, Rob. A documentary filmmaker posing as a conservative activist at a Supreme Court social event recorded the comments. She poses the question of whether or not the left and right can ultimately come together. Take a listen. Right. One side or the other. One side or the other is going to win. Uh, I, I don't know. I mean, there can be a, 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 a Way of working, a way of living together peacefully, but it's difficult, you know, because there are differences on fundamental things that really can't be compromised. The filmmaker Lauren Windsor also recorded Alito's wife, Martha Ann, complaining about a pride flag in her neighborhood and saying she wanted to fly a Catholic banner in response. The Alitos have come under scrutiny for displaying flags similar to those carried by supporters of former President Donald Trump during the January 6th insurrection at the U.S. Capitol. Windsor also spoke with Chief Justice John Roberts. He, however, rejected the notion that the court should lead the nation on a Christian path, saying, quote, I don't know if that's true. Now, the charity that hosted the event told the New York Times they condemned the recordings, calling them inconsistent with the spirit of the event. The filmmaker considers herself an advocacy journalist and says she paid for a ticket and used her real name at that event. So more fallout there, Rob and Alex. Mm. All right. Correspondent Julie Martin, appreciate your time. Thank you. Fascinating recording.